Pepe to Coinbase, those are the rumors that we're seeing on Twitter. In this episode, I'm going to give you three reasons why I believe that Pepe will get listed on Coinbase in 2023. I'll also give you some reasons why it might not potentially happen. If you're part of the Pepe community, hit that thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and leave a comment below. Say yes if you think we're going to see a Pepe listing in 2023. Say no if you don't think we're going to see a Pepe listing in 2023. Currently sitting at a $1.19 billion market cap. This thing climbed all the way up to a $1.6 billion market cap. Now, as you guys know, Pepe was listed on Binance. Pepe was listed on Crypto.com. Pepe was listed on Qcoin. Pepe was also listed on Bybit. These are four tier one exchanges that Pepe was listed on in the past three days. This has never been done before in cryptocurrency history. This token is less than 25 days old on over 50 exchanges, 110,000 plus holders, and ran all the way up to a $1.66 billion market cap. Now, the main exchange that has not listed Pepe yet is Coinbase. There's a few other small ones like Gemini and Kraken that are here in America that haven't listed Pepe, but Coinbase is the main one, the biggest one, that has not listed Pepe as of today. Let's talk about why this has happened. Now, the Coinbase is currently going through some sort of a lawsuit with the SEC. We know that the SEC issued a Wells notice to Coinbase in regards to their staking platform. But since then, the Coinbase has taken the fight back to the SEC. Uh, Brian Armstrong and team went to Washington, D.C. They went to the SEC headquarters, and they are fighting back and suing the SEC in order to get some sort of crypto regulation. Now, I do believe if this did not happen, Coinbase would have already listed Pepe on their platform. Now, the reasons why I do think we will see a Coinbase listing, and feel free to let me know if I'm wrong in the comments or if you agree with me. Number one, Coinbase listed SHIB back in 2021. Coinbase understands the volume. Coinbase understands the community. And Coinbase understands how important it is to list these tokens on their platform. Because at the end of the day, Brian Armstrong, all of the CEOs say it best. They make money from volume. When you trade on Coinbase, they make two, three, four, five dollars depending on the volume of trade. The more the trade, the more in dollar amount the trade, the more that they make. So they understand that Pepe on a slow day in a bear market is doing around a hundred million dollars in volume on a decentralized exchange. If they can just get a portion of that, they're going to be increasing their revenue, which let's be honest, it's been a tough bear market for a lot of these exchanges. So number one, the volume. Number two, their goal is to increase users on their platform. Their goal is to list good tokens. Like I said, they listed SHIB back in 2021. And guess what? It was one of the greatest things that they've done because it brought thousands, if not hundreds of thousands of users onto Coinbase. Pepe taking the crypto world by surprise today, guys. So many people are talking about it. I can't believe it's begin to tell you how many people have asked me, should I buy Pepe? Should I buy Pepe? Same things are happening with Brian Armstrong and people at Coinbase. Should I buy Pepe? Well, guess what? If it's listed on Coinbase, people will, will be able to buy it. Now, I want to talk about this rumor that's here because I actually uh, went through and checked it out a little bit. This guy, Undx, and ETH. I don't know if I pronounced that right. Undi underneath ETH, I guess. Uh, there is a Pepe placeholder on Coinbase very, very soon. Do y'all remember what happened when SHIB, when Coinbase listed it? It went parabolic. Shit went parabolic. But guys, I went on my phone. I went on my Coinbase account. And I'll be honest with you. I didn't find a placeholder. Now, you have this here. Let's see if it will focus. You have the Pepe listing here. But at the bottom, can you guys see this? It says buy with Coinbase wallet. So you can currently buy it with Coinbase wallet. I didn't find a Pepe placeholder on Coinbase myself. Maybe I didn't look in the right spot. But I didn't see that yet. But we do have it on the Coinbase wallet, which is the DeFi wallet. If it gets listed on Coinbase, guys, it would be absolutely parabolic. So the volume, the community, and also just the, the magnitude of listing a token of the size. Because look, at the end of the day, Coinbase is in competition with Binance. Coinbase is in competition with Qcoin. Coinbase is definitely in competition with Crypto.com. If they list these meme tokens and they have success, users are going to be flooding to those platforms and away from Coinbase. So I think that they want the user count, they want the volume, and obviously, guys, they want the community, and they want to have the support of the community around it. So I do believe we will see a Coinbase listing here in 2023. The only reason we haven't seen it yet is because of the lawsuit that's going on with the SEC. If Pepe continues to have its success, if Pepe continues to community, build, and if Pepe continues to sit above a billion-dollar market cap and climb the ranks of the coin market cap rankings in terms of market cap, I don't think it's going to be long before we see a Coinbase listing. That's my thoughts. Let me know yours in the comments, and we'll see you guys in the next episode.